Time now for Tasty Thursday, and if your idea of a romantic dinner involves some Italian food, well, you've come to the right place, maybe, for a Valentine's Day idea. Chef Mattia Lambertini and owner Cameron Lockley are here from Gusto, which is located in North Austin off of Burnett Road. Thank you guys so much for being here. Uh, I wanted to just quickly talk a little bit about the menu because Mattia joins us uh, from Italy, from Bologna, is that That's correct? That's right, correct. So this is uh, authentic made. It's very authentic, made everything from scratch eventually. It's very old school for my grandma. And we have some simple ingredients, they are potatoes, fresh tomatoes, eggs, and flour. And with all these ingredients, we will uh, go make some gnocchi. Mm -hmm. Gnocchi, are basically, they are very old school. They are probably 150 years ago from uh, my hometown. And we just make very, very simple. Like we put in the oven for 350 degrees uh, potatoes with some salt, so we bake it until the crust is gonna be get broken. At, okay. this, at this point, we will take them out the potatoes. We will mash with uh, flowers, some eggs, and a touch of oil for moisturize the dough. And okay. this is the dough that we will find in the hand. Okay, so this is what comes out of that. That's right. Okay. When we get this dough, we will refrigeration for like 30 minutes for let it chill out. Okay. Because they have to like addition together all the ingredients. Mm -hmm. And at this point, we are able to make us like little compost of gnocchi, mm -hmm. where we will just very simple boil it in the water, like a bunch of gnocchi, they take between two, three minutes, okay. because they have to just get warmer up. Mm -hmm. And because fresh pasta take like at the most three minutes for Now this is out. just boiling water? Boiling just water boiling with water. salt, so oh. for give extra taste. Okay. With and then over salt. there we will build them up like a tomato sauce, or made of course, we use vein tomatoes, and just mm -hmm. a little bit of basil and parsley and olive oil. And at this point, when we get the reduction of the tomatoes, mm -hmm. we will addition the gnocchi. Okay. And we will put on the table, in top to the dish, with some uh, Parmesan cheese, oil, and um, the, of course, this is the most important ingredient that we have in the house right now. I make everything from scratch. This is like a beautiful thing, ricotta. I just make yesterday for come here today. Wow. So yeah. So, so fresh ricotta cheese. That's right. So we try to play more fresh we can in the house all the time. So it can be very interesting for people try something very authentic and simple. Absolutely, and this is just kind of a, is this an appetizer? Is this this is an appetizer at the restaurant, and you know, at home you could serve gnocchi with brown butter and sage, you could put braised meat on top, serve it as a dish, as mm -hmm. a meal. Um, we serve it at the restaurant as an appetizer, as Matias said, with our pomodoro tomato sauce and uh, fresh hops made ricotta. Here is a look at the final product, if That's we can right. show it yeah. uh, right there with the ricotta in the middle. In the middle, that's right. And so we just celebrated our year anniversary at the restaurant. Congratulations. We're changing up the menu. Chef Matias added a few new items. The gnocchi is one of those dishes. Mm -hmm. And as you mentioned, we have Valentine's Day coming up this next week. We have a special three-course pre-fee menu for Valentine's. Hmm. You can find our regular menus, our Valentine's menus, and you can make reservations at our website. GustoItalianKitchen.com. Wonderful, wonderful. And and Mattia, how do you like Austin so far? Well, Austin is very nice. I like it, and uh, hopefully I'm going to be enjoy soon more I can outside the Austin downtown for try some new dishes and some new place. But for now, I'm very focused on uh, try make people happy, enjoy Italian food. So please, everybody, spend time and come see us at the restaurant. What What did you find from uh, from your part of Italy that you were kind of able to? To bring to us but actually like I have to say thank you to my wife actually so oh. here because uh, I was working in Italy in my bed and breakfast so family business uh -huh. and uh, my wife she was there two years ago in vacation so she found me and she brought <laughs> me here <laughs> all right wonderful well I hope you're prepared for 100 degree temperature uh, in the summer I will be prepared. I know you have seasons in Italy and, and here no season at no, all not yet or at least we haven't seen it yet <laughs> Mark